So you're thinking about moving to Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. Well, good choice. Today, we're gonna to show you all around this great town, take you to a couple different neighborhoods, hop in the car and show you a couple different houses at a few different price points, some single family, some townhomes. Right now, I'm on Main Street here in Mechanicsburg, historic part of the downtown area. A lot of great shops and bars, restaurants, cafes. We're gonna show you all that today and more, and we're gonna get real with it right now. If this is your first time to the channel, and you wanna know everything there is to know about living in the Harrisburg, Central Pennsylvania area, including right here in Mechanicsburg, then subscribe below and tap the bell for notifications. That way you can be the first to know about the current market right here in Central PA. My name is Aaron. Josh, the team and I, we get calls and emails every day from people just like you looking to make their move to the area. So whether you're moving now or in six months from now, give us a call, shoot us a text, or send us an email. All of our information is in the description below. That way we can help you make a smooth move to the area. All right, so like I said, in today's video, we're doing a deep dive into Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. Right now, I'm in the downtown part of Mechanicsburg on Main Street, which has a great historic vibe. You can see that if you walk around. Now, there's businesses and retail mixed into that, but again, typical to see uh, row homes here, uh, brick and mortar, you know, very old homes, 150 years old, 200 years old in some cases. Um, but really beautiful. You can see some of the, the pastel paints uh, and uh, the, the ornate crown molding above. Cute little yards. And this building actually is one of the oldest, if not the oldest, uh, structures here on Main Street in Mechanicsburg. The Frankenberger Tavern, which dates back to 1801. So a testament to the history here in Mechanicsburg. We're going to take you out to some neighborhoods, show you a few price points on some homes see what your money can buy you here. You know, we know the market's moving fast, guys, especially here in Mechanicsburg. This is a very sought after suburb, very sought after area. A lot of uh, high-end neighborhoods here, uh, a lot of neighborhoods that get a lot of buyer attention. So we understand that, we understand the market's moving fast. And we've had clients that have worked with other realtors that have called us, uh, they weren't able to get a deal done before. They call us at the Living in Central PA team and we're able to make things happen for them. So we're excited about that, we're happy about that, and we hope that this content helps you make informed decisions uh, and, and come and talk to us here at the Living in Central PA team. So we're gonna hop in the car and drive around a little bit, see some of these neighborhoods, and we'll check back in with you in a bit. Hey guys, so we got a special treat for you. We were down here on Main Street in Mechanicsburg, and we ran into the owner of the Gingerbread Man. This place has been here for about 50 years on Main Street in Mechanicsburg. There's also two locations in Harrisburg and one in Carlisle. We met the owner, he's renovating the entire building. They had a fire here in December of 2021 and he's renovating the entire building and a luxury apartments upstairs. So we're gonna show you some footage from that and hopefully in the next three or four months, this place is gonna be rocking and rolling again. So we'll come back here, grab a drink and a bite to eat once this place is back up and running. All right, so we actually got lucky enough to uh, run into this great gentleman who's a very well-known man here in Mechanicsburg. He owns the Gingerbread Man. There's a couple locations throughout Central PA, but as you saw downstairs, we're on Main Street in Mechanicsburg. This is Richard. Richard owns this building, and they've just renovated all these luxury apartments upstairs, and he's been nice enough to, to give us a little bit of a tour. So Richard, if you don't mind, can you, can you show us one of these places? <music>
So now we're just walking in uh, downtown Mechanicsburg. We just came from Main Street where we just were at the Gingerbread Man. We wanted to show you a house in, uh, inside the borough of Mechanicsburg, what they typically go for. Right here, this is coming soon on Locust Street. Here's an example of your traditional downtown Mechanicsburg home. This features three bedrooms, two full baths. This was built right around 1900 or earlier. The square footage would be right around 1,452. And the price tag on this is 205,000, bringing the price per square foot at right around $141. The annual taxes on this home is gonna run at about $2,800. And the school district is going to be Mechanicsburg Area School District. I don't believe this one's going to last very long. It's due on the market in about three days. And I would honestly give it about three days on the market until it's uh, under contract, probably with multiple offers. But yeah, this is your typical downtown Mechanicsburg home. And uh, now we're going to move off into a all-in-one community of Arcona. So we'll see you there. So here we are guys in Arcona. This is the Arcona neighborhood in Mechanicsburg. One of my favorite neighborhoods in, in the area really. The cool thing about this place is that it's an all-inclusive kind of self-contained community. You'll see if you kind of do a pan around, we're kind of in the central part of the square here. You've got a gym, you've got a cute little ice cream shop. Over here you've got a, a salon, a hair salon. You've got art galleries cafes, restaurants. This restaurant right behind us is called Thea. Really, really nice restaurant. Uh, across the way here, you've got the Springgate Vineyard and Winery. We'll take a look at that. This is a very popular neighborhood. About six years ago, everything around here was farmland. So this has really sprouted up very quickly. You've got young families moving in. Uh, you've got elderly that are downsizing. There's options for everybody. There's townhomes single family homes, carriage homes, and we're gonna show you one of each of those while we're here in this community. Starting about the mid 300s up into about the mid 500s for price range. Charter Homes is the builder here, and they've been doing wonderful work. They have another community, a sister community here in Mechanicsburg called Walden, and we're gonna go and, and, and show you a little bit of, of Walden as well. Uh, but take a walk with me. We're going to see some of what makes this area so great. We're going to check out some of the houses and we'll check back in with you in just a minute. So th this is a typical street here in Arcona, quaint quiet, you don't have a lot of traffic going by, very insular and, uh, and quiet here. A few other things about Arcona, they just built a brand new community pool, so all the members here have access to that. There's a courtyard, we just saw some guys playing some cornhole, enjoying this beautiful sunny day, uh, right across from Springgate Vineyard. So it's just really, really a great place. There's so many fun things to do, hiking and, and biking paths uh, and the like. We actually just uh, came up on a, on a home here, a townhouse. Uh, which is in line with, with this beautiful row of homes here. This is going for $395. It's a three bedroom, two and a half bath, just over 2,100 square feet here in Arcona. Two car garage. There is an HOA here in Arcona. It's just over a hundred bucks a month, but it's very inclusive. It takes care of all your common area maintenance. And of course you have access to all those amenities that we discussed. So this two-story townhome features a first floor primary suite, which is very desirable. It's in the West Shore School District, Cedar Cliff High School. The first floor open concept floor plan is absolutely gorgeous. The kitchen features granite countertops and stainless steel appliances, two dining area options and a wet bar. We all love a good wet bar. Cozy gas fireplace in the living room, which walks out to a fully fenced in patio. First floor also includes a laundry room, powder room, and a convenient storage closet under the stairs. In addition to the first floor master, there are two spacious bedrooms upstairs, 
full storage room on the second floor. You're absolutely going to love the convenience of being here in Arcona. All right, guys, so we're just down the street from where we just uh, showed you the townhouse. I wanted to give you kind of a perspective of how this community is kind of coming together. You can see back in the distance there, they're still building. I think that's probably a single family house back there. And there are some plots that are, that, are, that are spoken for that they're just breaking ground on. But you can see how beautiful these townhomes are here. And each of these kind of pockets has their own motif. So you have a lot of options in terms of design and the facades of these houses, whether you want a stone exterior or the, or the vinyl. Uh, or brick, you really have so many options in terms of those, those features and amenities. So, I mean, down here, there's still some construction going on. We were going to show you one of these single family homes uh, to compare that with the townhome that we just showed you. Different price point. Here, you're, you're looking at a base price of about $470, and that's going to be for four bedrooms, two and a half baths. You've got the two car garage here. And if you're interested in a new build construction, reach out to us and we can contact the builder. We've, we've worked with Charter for years and many of the other builders in this area. So you see a little courtyard area here, mailbox, and the road that leads you out to Lisburn, which takes you uh, back out of the community. So these are the Bennington single family home floor plan styles. Now they're gonna offer a floor plan of between 25 to 3200 square feet based on your preference. Living room off of one side with adjacent dining room. Great natural light in these homes. Kitchens offering plenty of cabinet space. Overflow into beautiful breakfast areas and spacious living rooms. Arcona includes nearly a dozen locally owned businesses like we showed you earlier right in the neighborhood. Uh, within a short walk of these homes as well. So that gives you an idea of what a single family home will run you here. Again, base price here is about 470. With, with the different choices and the different uh, design patterns, you can be looking at as much as about 550 to 600, depending on your preferences. All right, so here we are at our second all-in-one community in Mechanicsburg. This is the community of Walden. Earlier, we were at Arcona. Like we said earlier, it's the same builder for both communities. Arcona is located on the east side of Mechanicsburg in the 17055, close to the city of Mechanicsburg. And this is located on the opposite side in the 17050 zip code. But just like Arcona, it's gonna have all kinds of the same amenities. Uh, we got a pizza shop over here, a fitness center behind us, coffee shop over here to the right, uh, restaurants, um, salon, so oh, basically all the same kind of uh, amenities as Arcona. All right, so if you're interested in living one of these communities, definitely reach out to us. Now here in Walden, they pretty much stopped construction. They're pretty much finished with this uh, community, whereas Arcona, there's still a lot of new builds out there. So if you're looking for a new build, keep that in mind. Uh, if you're looking for an existing home, we can also help you out with that. Now we're going to take you down to a home or two in the community. One of them I just settled on last week. Uh, but before that, we're going to stop in here at Home Slice and grab a slice and continue our pizza tour. So check out our short video coming soon on uh, Home Slice Pizza in Walden. All right, so here we are at a single family home in the community of Walden. Just like their sister neighborhood, Arcona, which we showed you earlier, they're gonna have a mixture of townhomes, carriage homes, as well as single family dwellings. This home behind me, we just closed on last week. Uh, one of my buyers, they couldn't love it more. All right, this home features three bedrooms, two full baths, and one half bath. The square footage is right around 2,300. 
This was built in 2013. We are in Silver Springs Township and the school district is Cumberland Valley, which is, I believe, the second largest in the entire state. It's also ranked up with one of the highest in the state as well. The taxes on this come in at about $4,500 per year. And then we settled on a price of 510,000. And surprisingly in this market, we actually got a little bit of seller help with this home. The price per square foot is right around 218. Moving our way west, we are now in a beautifully exclusive neighborhood. We're going to show you a house just down the street. The homes in this area are about 450 to 550. They do include a small yearly HOA, which covers your common area maintenance. I believe it's about $45 a year, so very, very small. Very quiet, very quaint. Beautiful homes in this neighborhood, nicely manicured lawns, uh, and just a very, very sought after part of Mechanicsburg. So we have a lot of buyers calling in about this neighborhood. If you're interested, reach out to us at the Living in Central PA team. Keep in mind, uh, this neighborhood runs right uh, along the Conan de Gwinnett Creek. So many of these homes, you just go right in your backyard and you can go fishing in the creek. You can go tubing in the summer months. You're also just a stone throw away from the Carlisle Pike, which we'll, we'll show you some footage of. That's one of the main thoroughfares uh, here in Mechanicsburg. So come with me down the street. We're going to show you this beautiful house. It's listed at about 465, and we'll check in with you after that. So this beautiful home is located here in Hampton Township in the Cumberland Valley School District. It's listed at 439.9. Just went on the market today, and believe it or not, at a price point of 439.9, your yearly tax is still under 4,000 a year at $3,900. It's got four bedrooms two full baths, two half baths. It's got 2,500 square feet of above ground square footage and an additional 800 below ground. So you're looking at about 3,300 total square footage, which is fantastic for the price. Additionally, you're a short distance to Wurtsville Road and the Carlisle Pike, as we said. It's Cumberland Valley School District. One of the best things about this home is that in the backyard you have a great view and access to the Conan de Gwinnett Creek and it's not in the floodplain. So you can relax by the creek, do some floating. Beautiful wood fireplace in the family room with uh, distinct masonry design. Many, many updates including new carpet upstairs and down, new bathroom updates and a large finished walkout basement. That walkout is key. You can make it into a bedroom. Uh, and it just really is, adds some, so much convenience in terms of uh, moving in and out with the, the uh, walkout in the basement. There's even a workshop under the garage. So let's, uh, let's keep moving on on our tour and keep this one in mind. So we're going to finish out this video with our last house. Uh, this home is in Rayburn Estates. It's running right around $950,000. Upper Allen Township, but still in Mechanicsburg School District. All right, so this home features four bedrooms, three full baths, two half baths, a little over 3,200 square feet. Like I said, in Upper Allen Township, Mechanicsburg Area School District. The HOA fee is gonna run you right around $138 quarterly. This price point right here is $950,000, which gives you a price per square foot at right around $288. This home was built in 2018, and taxes on this home will run you just over $12,000 per year.
All right, so we're gonna finish today's video in one of the most exclusive, if not the most exclusive neighborhoods in Mechanicsburg, and that is the neighborhood of Pinehurst. It is absolutely gorgeous to walk through the streets here. These homes go for well over a million dollars. If you are interested in moving to Pinehurst or any of the neighborhoods you've seen in this segment, anywhere in Mechanicsburg, anywhere in central Pennsylvania, reach out to myself or Aaron, any member of our team, and we'd be happy to help you make the move to the area. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more just like it, make sure you subscribe below and tap the bell for notifications. That way you can be the first to know about the current market right here in Mechanicsburg. My name is Aaron. I'm Josh. With the Real Central PA team. Until next time, keep it real.